Hi, I'm Unequal, a creator on IronView, and today I'll be showing you how to derive a product using IronView Studio. Before we begin, what exactly is deriving? We have primary products and derived products in the IronView catalogue. Primary is usually the first product including all basic geometry or the parent product. Derived products inherit all the parent attributes, but usually override a few features, mainly being texture overrides. For example, you may derive from the top and change its basic colour. To start a new project in Lineview Studio, we can simply go to File, New, or click the small plus icon, or go to our Home, My Projects tab and click the Create button found in the top right corner. As you can see, we now have a new window showing derivable products we can use to create our own products for our store. You can have a scroll and find what you were looking for that way, but today we'll be searching for a particular product to use. Using the search bar, I'll be searching for the product ID to grab the exact product I'd like to derive from. However, you can just type what it is you want using the product's name or type of product you want to use. So for example, I'll be deriving from a pair of oversized glasses today. So I can simply type in oversized glasses and then search by accessories under categories to refine our search. And here we have many options to choose from when looking for oversized glasses. Today, however, I do want to derive from a particular product. So we will need the product identification number, otherwise known as PID, which is a unique number given to a product when uploaded to the store. The product ID can be found by finding the product on either IMVU Classic or IMVU Next and copying the numbers found at the end of the URL. We can simply right click, copy, open up IMVU Studio and then Control V using our keyboard to paste that into the search bar. Make sure to click search by PID so we can easily grab that particular product. Once we've clicked our product, we can now see on the right that the window is updated to show the whole derived chain as well as our avatar showcasing the product. Here we can also select products earlier on in the derived chain to use if we prefer to do so. We can also enlarge this view to preview our product before we hit the derive button. If we search for a product using its name or product ID number and it does not appear, then that means the product was set as not derivable by its creator and we cannot use such products. However, if you set your own product to non-derivable, you will still be able to derive from your own products. Now that we have the product we'd like to derive from, click on Derive and enter the Editor tab inside IronView to start creating. 